Okay everyone, in this video I'm gonna show you how you can cancel the Audible subscription on your iPhone. Keep in mind that I actually really enjoy Audible, I have nothing against them, but in case you want to cancel the subscription, here's what you need to do. First of all, you can see I have the Audible app on my iPhone, and the first thing I have to explain is that you can have like many different subscriptions at the same time for Audible. Because if you open up the app like this and you try to log in, you can see there's this little marketplace stuff going on at the bottom. So you can actually log in with a different country. So you can, for example, have an account on Audible USA, on Audible Australia, and all of these different marketplaces. And you can set up subscriptions for basically any of them. So you can pay like 10 different subscriptions at the same time, technically. But the thing is that usually people don't have that. I, for example, have the Audible Germany. So in case I just want to click on that, I can continue and log in with my um, account. So yeah, that's like first thing to pay attention to. But in case you want to cancel the subscription, what you have to do is to open up these settings on your iPhone and just click on your name at the top right there. Then proceed to the subscriptions page like this. And you can see here is going to be the list of all of the active subscriptions. For me, it is literally only Snapchat, but it doesn't matter which app you can see in here. Just imagine that it's not Snapchat, but Audible. The process is exactly the same. So you just click on it and you can cancel the subscription or a free trial, whatever you have going on. So you just click on that and you can cancel that subscription. Or you can tap on a see all plans and depending on the app, you can switch to something else. So with Snapchat, I have so many different options available to me. So this is how you can do it. Keep in mind, and this is an important disclaimer, this is the way, this is how it works only if you have paid the subscription, if you have started through the Apple payments. If you have started it on the iPhone, then you can find it in the subscription page, which I just showed you. However, this may not be the case. Perhaps you just started the subscription on your computer for that account and then downloaded the Audible app on your iPhone later. This is a possibility as well. So in this case, you can still open up the Audible app and just sign out or get to this page where you're trying to log in. And at the bottom, you have the cancel membership. So I can click on that and it just tells me that I am supposed to like log in and tell me the name and type in all of the stuff and the reason why I'm doing that. It's actually in German, so you cannot really see that. So if I switch to a different language, so let me just switch to Audible USA. And right now it doesn't allow me to, to actually cancel the subscription for whatever reason. So it's kind of interesting. However, what you can do in this case, if none of the methods which I mentioned work for you, what you can still do is to go to your computer, go to the Safari or any web browser and look up audible.com or .ca, whatever you're using, whichever marketplace. I just logged into audible.de, which is the Germany stuff I logged in so you can see my name is there and what I can click on is basically this little thing and go to my account which is this button right here so I go to my account and here I can manage my audible subscription so you can see that I just get like one audiobook per month and it's like of course all of the things are explained but when I'm actually trying to cancel it it tells me that when I have to do this I have to basically go to the Apple because the payments are done through Apple. So I have to click on Apple like this and it just moves me over to the Apple page and shows the actual tutorial, which I did show you in the beginning. So this is what you have to do. This is how you can stop the subscription from being paid. So because, um, yeah, at the end of the day, you can always just go to the Audible and see how exactly you created that subscription and that's how you can do it. For me, the reason, and this is one last thing, because I don't want to like confuse you, it's not really that deep, but I'm just trying to hit every single angle and possibility that could have happened to you. In my case, as you can see, when I go to these settings and to my subscriptions, I only have the Snapchat here. But the reason for it is that my Audible subscription has begun or has been made with a different app ID. So what I have to do is just to grab another iPhone, which I have, the 14 Pro, with different app ID and go to the same section in the settings like that and just click on it then and I don't have the Fox tag on my different iPhone. I have my personal Apple ID, click on the subscription and there I will find the Audible. So I just cancel it the same way but through or from different Apple ID. 
So this is how you can cancel your Audible plan. And these were all of the possible options and every single thing you have to know about it. So I'm going to wrap up the video right now. Before I do, I'm going to have to show you the Fox Tech educational platform, which you can join for free. It is a place where I created because people are not using their iPhones to the fullest potential. So that's why I created a couple of different courses, video editing guides, in-depth iPhone guides. I'm currently working on the full tutorial for Dynamic Island. So definitely go ahead and join it right now and I will see you inside. For now, thanks a lot for watching. See you guys in the next Fox Tech video.